Hello, we're looking at Valeritate rules and the basic first rule of Valeritate. In Afrikaans, we use het and a g to our main verb to make it into the past tense. So if we look at the first sentence, Ek lees elke dag a boek by die huis. Now remember when we did stompy, you will find verb 1 in the second position in your sentence. So lees in this sentence is your verb. So I read every day a book at home. And what happens in if it is you simply say ek, het becomes your verb one. Everything else stays in exactly the same position. So ek het elke dag a book by die huis and gelees becomes your verb two. So you've added a het and a ge to your main verb lees, but het is verb one, gelees is verb two. Sometimes you guys want to say, ek het gelees, elke dag a boek by die huis. That is incorrect. Het and gelees, verb 1 and verb 2, split. Look at this one. So your verb is stop. So I walk in the mornings around the block to relax. Now as soon as you have this omte ontspan, that is your infinitive. And remember when we did stompy, verb 1 and verb 2 come before the infinitive. So you can almost ignore the infinitive. And do your past tense as normal. Ek het sochens om die blok gestap. First you finish your sentence with verb 2 and then it's the infinitive after that. Om te ontspan. What sometimes happens is I get Ek het sochens om die blok om te ontspan gestap. But of course verb 2 does not pass the infinitive. So there you have the basic het and ge rules about verleeritate. If you want to see what to do when you start with a time word, that will be in a separate video.